watching AYV Television. We are chairman of Renaissance. Uh, and Renaissance was considered to be an independent body uh, that advocates for change. Let me put it So, so I'm not asking you to ask you to ask about. You we are, we are Minister of Information, where President Koma announced austerity measures from State House. Yes. No matter if you're in free quality, education, and I am against that, I will not accept. This is not President Bio's free quality education. So the economy went bad from your own time. Is you not Bioist or yes. you not Pauper? Pau -pau. I will feel difficult for interpreting the, the connotations that they as the anti-corruption commissioner, have you been approached to be compromised or corrupted in the matter you're investigating? Don't they talk about the ills of the country for years, mm -hmm. five years to election? I know them. President Bio at the time, Nabi Mumu. Fambul, welcome to AYV Television on Channel 33. We also the broadcast online at www.ayvnews.com. We the stream live on our Facebook page, Africa Young Voices Media Empire. This is uh, the talk show, Hot Seat. The program where um, they ask the questions the same week you want for ask. We the talk to politicians, people in public service, um, civil society, the media and business. We the talk to people them, about um, how we for develop this country. What they do in the young corner, whether as politicians, whether as uh, somebody with all public position, what everybody they do for push salon go before. Um, as always, I welcome we VSM across the country and across the world, and then specifically, we fumble with the following our Facebook page. Um, we all can agree for disagree. We can get with different views them about issues them what they discuss at the program. But with the appeal say, we agree for disagree responsibly. Let me not abuse nobody. We all get different opinions. Everybody gets to like the support. Everybody gets the interest. But the bottom line is, we all want a better salon. Now the bigger picture than the, no matter whose party you support or whose camp you day, but you want this country for go before. Because as I can always say, for most of we, um, we don't get other nationality. Now salon no more is a bin, we day, now we don't born, now we don't grow up, and we don't get no side for go. So um, let me be responsible, give you contribution, and we can always uh, appreciate our suggestions them. Some of the questions they want to ask as well can be uh, very helpful to this program. So let me make a res respectful and peaceful na the platform. Now, so I welcome on the program today. We can't talk politics inside the young program. It has been a busy weekend. Um, the two major political parties, them, the SLPP been to get the lower level elections, them, na some areas, besides some council. We see the APC, the main opposition, they have been getting them. Emergency um, Congress, na McKinney, where the courts be ordered them for do for go adopt the constitution. Um, then this have been happening. So they can discuss that specifically inside the program today. And I get the pleasure to get with me um, CD Tunis uh, in uh, the Acting Publicity Secretary of the APC Party. Tunis, welcome to the program. Thank team. you very much. Uh, glad it is a pleasure here. having you. This is not the first time forget you are. Oh, yes. I yeah. mean, I'm the first time on the hot seat. I know. <laughs> You're very much welcome. <laughs> I know you, you, you. You, you sit very comfortable. You know, my way always very comfortable. Um, yeah. But how has it been for you? You, I, I just want to ask generally about uh, politics and, you know, I'm possibly serve as minister in the former government, the previous administration. Um, you now you've been the oversee the tourism sector. Um, what's in your current assessment of specifically that sector? Today? You know, as somebody... We, I'm sure you've been on the push policies them or reviews of laws. What's, what's in your general assessment? I think they, they, they carry through with plenty of the policies and uh, programs they were able to work on before they left, before I left. Mm. And some of them, you know, in terms of uh, support, they increase on the portfolio and, um, you know, and they expand the coverage, you know, um, to a large extent. So in terms of policies and impl implementation of programs, I see them, you know, then, then continue on mm. with um, some of the programs that were left. What means say we they do well in the tourism sector? Well, I, 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 I not go say so because mm. tourism is not just about, um, you know, programs. You mm. get so many things that we, we attach to them. Mm. Even government overall, you know, performance can affect the tourism sector. Happenings across the world can affect the tourism sector. 
we internal, you know, governance behaviors. Mm. If we get, you know, bad investment climate, if we get bad human rights records, if we get, um, you know, bad governance generally, um, if we get, um, you know, bad, inv um, you know, environmental policies, then mm. all of them things, then they can affect the tourism sector. And so, as sure say, the overall governance performance, they negatively impact on the tourism sector. And even in some areas, <coughs> we, we policies around how we don't carry on, you know, doing things that some of them tourist attractions, then they currently know they make them too but, but attractive the minister, for the minister is on record, and even the president, they, they're on record. This government is on record of saying, you know, <coughs> they've, exp they, they've opened up the country so much that, uh, you know, don't receive a lot of, before COVID, we had a lot of tourists who came, we see presidents don't give nationality to um, African Americans, then we come and, and show allegiance to the country. So they've opened up. The minister has been traveling to international conferences, showcasing cell. You know, things that not progress? A lot. I mean, that are, that are just one aspect of the tourism sector, which mm. is really what um, the National Tourist Board does. That are for do marketing and, you know, rebranding of the country. Mm. And it is something that, um, you know, they don't do. But like I stated, I mean, you get for measure that they are against the actual tourist numbers. And when you go to, you know, the hospitality industry as well, you know, what has been the actual impact positively, you know, on, the, on that sector day. Uh, but like I stated in my opening, to a large extent, they don't they do well. There has been progress. Up. Yes. Okay. I mean, I sure say COVID could affect them also. And, um, you know, because of the COVID, a lot of the programs that we be done, they don't, they be done, they attend outside, we go give them the opportunity for brand, mm -hmm. probably don't affect it. But I sure say also on a wider uh, to a wider extent, the government self self then policies not to help this sector. So, so, so uh, did that go bring me to the question about um, your assessment of politics and governance in the country? Um, three years in, in the leadership of President Bio, um, he's, he's implemented the free quality education, and um, he, 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 we see Usaido repeal the criminal libel law. The death penalty saved and don't pull on our law books. Gender empowerment bill D in the corner. A lot of other things. Um, don't you think? Do you think there, there has been po progress in, in governance I and politics? I think country? President Bill in policies them so far as as I am concerned as a politician. You know, I mean, in policies them so much not the um, for impact the the internal you know, or the country internally. But free quality education. I think in policies, they're more focused on, um, you know, either cleaning up or building his image mm. externally, mm. you know, f making sure that in government look good externally. Mm. Uh, but in policies, them, you know, not more of pronouncements than implementation. And because but, but, but of the free quality education is yeah, one it's, 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 it's one project, it's flagship program. That's you know, a lot of enrollment has increased. You get a lot of picking the way they go school way. <coughs> Government don't increase on, on, on the budgetary allocation to the education sector, then they pay school fees and they pay exams fees for school picking. There. Is that not touching the ordinary people? When the previous government left, mm -hmm. the budget allocation to education was 18% or 19%. Mm -hmm. And it's over 20% uh, okay, now. Okay, fine. So, which means they don't add two percentage mm. points. Mm -hmm. And when the previous government left, you been get over 2.5 2 million or two, so overall enrollment of the categories of uh, people within mm. the target. Mm. I don't know what the figures are now. Yeah, the figure has increased. But the when, when, you, there's when, been an increase. when you look at waiting then promise mm. and waiting then they implement if it is far below the the way hard and the project the free quality education mm. thing not mm. get me wrong it mm. is a very good policy mm -hmm. because i mean human capital development everywhere is mm. needed for mm. the overall development of the nation mm -hmm. but then you have to be able to first of all match you know your pronouncement with um 
waiting you that the actual where you don't deliver mm -hmm. waiting at but the it's outcome three years. It's three you know, years. it is three years yes yeah but how many classrooms have we added mm, yeah, how many the, the, the president just commissioned <laughs> about 200 classrooms uh, rehabilitated 50 percent of them classrooms then they mm -hmm are done by private institutions. And yes, then, then but, go but it's, and part, then it's go part of... It's the well, president no, has been calling for no, private but sector you involvement. You know, but you know, go, have you been... Know, go have go been I, was, I was in Port Loco where the president commissioned the, the school with Mercury Bill. Exactly. And he gave example to Mercury. Say, free quality education could not only mean government. They call for private sector involvement. But fact is, there are classrooms. It just launched commission classrooms. Just under the PDT alone. Mm -hmm. The presidential delivery team mm -hmm. post Ebola, mm -hmm. 500 classrooms were built mm -hmm. by the previous administration just mm -hmm. under that, you know. So now that make us say, I mean, a few they talk and so much resources they come in, and mm -hmm. you say you're spending so much resources. Let us see what the government itself is doing mm. for impact and improve that sector. Mm. Mercury don't build so many schools where the government they go launch. Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't go consider that and this in a government program. Yeah, but that is but, a private but, but sector. But not compliment, program. complement yeah, the efforts <laughs> of government. Yeah, but then you know, you know, let us see as a government what mm. has been done. I mean, even in terms of um, the teaching quality, mm. how much quality would we attach to the education? Because mm. we see the failures; they go up. I mean, they are seed and they make all kinds no, of... But, but according to the minister, I say that's there, there, has been, there has been changes. That is, that is according to data. Data is showing that there has been changes. And one thing where the government don't do now that... For, like, you've been the talk... The point where there is now that you say the p p president in policies and programs so they impact the ordinary Sierra Leonean. Now, pay and then they go buy scratch card again. They're saving money. They just need to go on their phone and check results for their kids. Isn't that impacting in the lives of the ordinary yeah, people? Yeah, but then how much more they get for spend on uniform? How mm. much more they get for spend on shoes? But you're saving how, somewhere. How much more? <laughs> At <laughs> least not to that time where you get for much, spend on scratch card, you spend more, on uniform. But you're they, saving on scratch card, you can spend somewhere else. How much more they get for spend on food? Mm. So take... take so there's school feeding program no, but, as well. Uh, but where? The idea is NGOs no, it and the is partner. It's not even 20% at yeah, that Yeah, but, but it's there. It's you impacting. Know, it's affecting It has some, reduced some drastically from where it was. Mm. This is what I'm saying. So now they do more than oh, now. Of they course. Do now. They know that. <coughs> they know that one day for sure mm. that with school feeding program be more, you know, organized and, you know, um, encompassing than it is now. And we feel we, 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 we and, and, and this is really <coughs> waiting uh, when you make pronouncement as if it is universal, and then when you look at the actual mm. way they happen, it is not even 15 percent. Okay. That is where me get problem, okay. as you know, because the government get policies were good, mm. but so far tell us that this policy we are we don't come this far, and with the you know this not the improvement we don't make or this not the challenges we would face. Okay, but it is as if we don't get challenges. Everything is, you know, fine. The parents are saving hundreds of thousands of loans, and that is really not the case. We, we can't talk about the APC um, Congress soon, but quickly I will ask you about the democratic credentials and governance of, of President Bill. Um, former President Kuma promised repeal of the Part 5 of the libel law. He didn't. President Bill came in Duam. The death penalty has been expunged from our law books. Don't you think President Kuma is more, uh, has shown to be uh, more democratic than we would have been in a government. Opening up the space, the civic space, working with civil society, allow the media for thrive as an independent institution or independent body. I mean, you get for a look at, um, you know, the level where the two governments then come in. Mm -hmm. um, the, the stage at which President Kroman came in, in with democratic stage and where President Bill came in. You know, a lot of the discussions or the things that we President Bill can implement, the discussion started mm -hmm. before he came in. Like we, this, the, the, the structure for help for work on the repeal of the criminal libel law be done day. Mm -hmm. You know, before he came in, the ministers don't take him to cabinet here and there, discussions don't happen. But he did it in three years. Right, you before, promised before, 11 before, years. Before you President, didn't do it. President Bill came in. Mm. Right, the same with the death penalty and mm. other things, you know. But then we give kudos; mm. they don't repeal the criminal libel law. But mm. 
you know, we also now have um, <laughs> a bill that is even more worrisome and dangerous than the criminal libel law, which mm. is the cyber crime bill, mm. where a lot of us, they still they grapple with, you know, some of the provisions in there. I mean, we work on a lot with Twicam, yeah. you know, for you maybe... You were involved in it. Yes, I was. Una. Yes, for mm. it be more acceptable mm -hmm. as it... As it as and the members know. of parliament approved it. And they, and they did. They, they I mean, because after a lot of tweaking, you know, it mm. became... We, it, it was going to be approved So anyway, should we so say President Bio has shown himself to be more democratic? I don't think so. When you look at his, his way of dealing with um, the general populace, the, his way of dealing with opposition parties, mm. you know, I don't think the space has been open. We don't get more opposition figures arrested under this administration than any democratic administration I can remember in this mm -hmm. country. Mm -hmm. We don't get more civil society activists arrested under this administration than any mm -hmm. administration I can uh, you know, mm -hmm. think of in this country. Mm -hmm. We don't get more musicians arrested under mm -hmm. this administration than any other administration mm -hmm. I can mm -hmm. think of in this country. Mm -hmm. This is not the only administration where people in high offices mm -hmm. They threaten people who get opposing views with mob justice. Mm. I mean, when you see them kind of things, then they, you not go say the, demo, the I, government I, 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 democratic. What should what in someone else go say? When I arrested a lot of journalists, detain them. When I arrested civil society people as well, when I detain them. Some even were taken to court and uh, later they get for big the presidents before they left them. Former uh, President Bio now, when he was in op in, uh, in opposition, his his office was his house was such. You well, know, you, you, you under get, some allegations at the end, nothing happened to you him. Get, you get for try for distinguish mm. um, things that will happen um, involving ind individuals than mm. from that of government. Mm -hmm. If problems happen between two individuals, mm -hmm. even if I'm a minister, somebody... Mm. Will you use your power? Some, no, well, not necessarily. Yeah, nah, but if, if minister no, calls here and he says, go if arrest that man, then go well, arrest It is wrong. <laughs> but if me and minister... But that was, that was how it was no, happening. But if me and minister, mm -hmm. then somebody... Because me and minister, you want to take advantage of mm -hmm. me as mm -hmm. if me not get right. Mm -hmm. You say something about me or you publish something about me mm -hmm. we're not correct. Mm -hmm. I get right for take action. Yeah, yeah, you, yeah, you so definitely those get are, right. So but then, not so that way so we just call police, say, so then go arrest that man and then go arrest and then detain and so then can instance, But you did that, right? So no, what, not, Ministers and did, not did. Really. I'm not talking to you as an individual. No, not that people I'm, in our government where you've been served, they did that. I know say people and get problems with certain individuals, mm -hmm. whether it be journalists, whether it mm -hmm. be civil society, where mm -hmm. action and, and coming. And sure that they were arrested. Action Even coming. Even the president had and issues and with and people. And, and, and you say, and when the government, where we ca we know, say, mm -hmm. it was wrong, we make sure, say, they left the person. Mm -hmm. And it, the matter no ever continue. Mm -hmm. But you're not going to arrest somebody mm -hmm. six months, mm -hmm. even where you know it was wrong, you still keep them for six months, and in the end, you just free them. Mm -hmm. Somebody, they in incarceration, it mm -hmm. all meet all in bail requirements, and mm. then you still hold on there. But that the, because, that the judiciary, recently you know. <laughs> when I the judiciary has been an independent institution no, we after commend the passing we commend That has nothing to do with the no, president. No, we commend the, the judiciary, judiciary for that, for a singular action he uh, took okay. of sending us to, okay. you know, now that make I insist, that not mean say, mm. I will give a, a you know, So if you, finally, right finally away. on this issue, if you are, if you are to rate President Bill over 100, for the entire government. Yes, governance in three years. I'll give him 25%. That's fail. Yes, he's failing. He's Woefully. I mean, look at the, 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 our prices are going up on a daily basis. Mm. You know, the economy is in, is in shattered. Mm. You know, the dollar is going up. You, you, know, you and, don't think so and, that and you, know, you just mentioned I recently no, said the man get policies and way good, the fee quality education no, is not a bad policy. but that is policy. just one. The man don't repeal, that is law will not repeal for no, 11 years. No, but that is just one. <laughs> no, but, but this, this, these are the things that... that now I make a talk say, mm. the man all in care about, mm. not things the way he go make pronouncements where the world go say yes. But these are part of the governance system. But he know they work. Lama, he know they work. I mean, now we economy day in shambles. 
where all other heads of states then sit down and then country then they attend meetings via Zoom. No, no, but not, all, not, all, not to all heads of states. Yeah, a, but lot of, a lot of not leaders compare are there. We to them. No, a lot of leaders. Look at him. But, 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 he is there on a ministerial conference. What did <laughs> President go do on ministerial so leadership you think programs? So you think, say, no, it, 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 was the, no, it was there based on the invitation now of Harvard University. Now waste of money. But you know, she's been a minister. Yeah, we go na Harvard. yeah but ministers. Attend. Yeah, but he's invited the to be a keynote speaker. No, no, he's not attending. Enough, I don't get one no, problem no, if na no, minister No, he's not go. attending the mini, you know, he's not attending the training. He went there as a key. He was invited to be a keynote speaker. Because if you don't lobby for let they invite you as keynote speaker. So now, so now, the lobby. No, then so lobby. Then lobby. Well, don't yeah. forget, say. No, but former President Koma attended a lot of international say, activities. Yeah, was he lobbying as well? Program. Not forget, say, them I had to pay plenty of money mm. to lobbyists for let them So now, 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 evidence is don't come out. Who's one? We all, they read the Africanist. I know, but so, so, okay, the programs are where former President Koma been, they go, he was lobbying, was it that because well, there not been the report there, but he was lobbying. If too. me not president, mm. then go lobby for La go attend ministerial program mm. as no the president was not attending the ministerial program. They invite he was doing the ministerial opening. leadership program. No, he was doing the opening of, of a conference of a, of, 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 a, of a conference. That's any leader can do, no? Well, no president, but that, come on. Did the president come out attend events like that? Sometimes I, I mean Lamrana under the circumstances who they face. Enough now. for go. No. So you think save say, money? The, the under attend to the to attend to the needs the of the under, people of the this country. The under twenty, Mark who you games. But we had president, former president Kuma. We had president, former president Kuma traveling even during Ebola. It's a lot of country. Yeah, on Ebola conferences. So why should we Ebola stay? Conferences. Why not for stay and send other persons? Why conferences. not? Why 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 not? Because not these were heads of person. these were heads of state invited. <laughs> on, on Ebola so conferences. So he's invited too. Yeah, Why shouldn't not, he go? Nothing for do with COVID. They, but he's invited no, as, but as Lama, someone. Nah, the man like fly. Is, is it not an unfair comparison? No, he likes travel. Okay. He yeah. has travel. So now make you get on 25. He has travel more than any president with me know it. So now make you get on 25. No, not to that. Now the, the circumstance, he asked me, but mm. me assessment of the overall governance performance. Mm. And I'm a fair and honest assessment now I don't give of this government. I mean, low look, all of them programs where they make noise for. The only one way they work small, mm -hmm. you know, I go say three. And that are because probably the the the, the minister with the education, basic and secondary, a push full, you know, is always out in the media mm -hmm. here and there talking. You know, um um lately we don't see some improvements in, in education. Yeah, well in basic in, education. In, well, I know in, in basic education, I go assess the pass mark. Mm. You know, focus on the quality. For access, they don't increase access. That mm. I will not deny it. Okay. But, you know, we have to look at the quality aspect of it. And we need for also be able for assess really which are the actual savings, okay. if any, mm. with parents then they make you know, with this free quality education okay. thing we didn't talk about. All other things, agriculture, in fire water is mm. worst. Light has improved, electricity uh, Oh, has yes, improved. that's the other thing I was going to say. Okay. I mean, for So now you will get 25 oh, out yeah, of, of course. Uh, all the things that I mean, we demand, so demand, don't forget, demand passed, don't forget, the, demand the man, do don't for forget, say the man get over mm. 60 ministries and deputy ministries. So mm. if he, if two, well, he's just so three years. Two, if he's two just part, three years. Now, now, just three years you the assess and so he you did 11 that years. Is, that is more in, 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 in one year, mm. Lamrana. Mm. Don't forget, in 2007, mm -hmm. in one year, we were able to restore electricity in yeah, Fulton. You, you, you remember the in income one, electricity and one, uh, corruption in case? In one year, we <laughs> be don't begin for charity streets and Africa, mm. but begin to and we first three years, mm. almost every major district in this country been to see development. Okay. So uh, not, not to excuse that one okay. day. When you become a government, governance, that I make you the courage you manifest to say you get solution to the problem. Okay, so we'll go take you 25% as you mark um, for the president in, in, in three years. Um, hopefully in the next two years before it's um, com com complete, we'll get you back for understand your assessments. But this now sits where they can't talk about the APC um, Congress, uh, emergency con Congress we have on the McKinney. Um, city, when I go into this, when I be need for abide in accordance to um, the High Court's ruling where Justice Adrian Fisher been given. Mm -hmm. How when I go into this 
Congress. So now, now it will meet up all the things and they will go make them all charge now for contempt of court. Well, it's been tough, but um, you know, we don't get um, you know, green light so far from the PPRC, will be the supervisor. We say we meet um, the court order to the letter. Well, you know, the things that we, the court asks we for do, first, we being for set up a 21 man committee. We now in suggest the composition, how, in terms of numbers, how that 21 man committee for look like. That 21 man committee now be for plan and prepare we for this conference, which we did. And we be for submit the draft constitution to the PPRC, to the courts and also publish them in two major newspapers, widely circulated newspapers daily. We did that. We've been supposed to hold elections. We've not been like the toughest thing. 166 elections in total in about 11 days. Five um, delegates each from all the 132 constituencies, 20 for Women's Congress and 20 for the Youth League. And we did those. We've been supposed to publish and make available, we'll be supposed to make available list of all registered members to the PPRC and that list in I before be the voter register for their elections then they we did that and uh, we be for um, publish the delegates list on the seventh will be for submit the list to PPRC we did that and on the eighth will be for publish the delegate list now the party head office and uh other areas we did that and then of course the final and before go down into the convention itself after drawing up the agenda with the 21 man committee and so now so we come all the way on mm. the 17th we begin the emergency national delegates conference itself proper but when i go into this election when i get election same way when i not being complete yes. how were mm -hmm. those people represented well, in the first place, um, I, I will explain a few things let people understand, really. Mm. Then, then constituencies, then they all get um, secretaries, when are automatic delegates. Some of them had MPs, members of parliament, when are automatic delegates. But in any case, let me also understand, say, this is now emergency national delegates conference. And in emergency national delegates conference, for let the delegates that be well constituted, you need one third of the total number of delegates provided for in the constitution. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. In the 1995 constitution, now 1,245 delegates then provided for. Of course, the judge be not exclude 160 of them and then they be due to the court order. Okay. And so that include executive members. Correct, including myself. Sitting but you were there. I was there, but I did not participate as mm. a delegate okay. and not vote and nothing. We were there because it also ordered we for organize the conference. Okay. Okay. So that's why we were there as executives. Mm -hmm. You know, so when um, so one third of that number is about 410, 416 people really will be need for day for let the conference start. Mm -hmm. Now. For let them vote for adopt the constitution, mm -hmm. you need two thirds of the delegates present for vote yes okay. for let the constitution pass. And when we do it, when we do the roll call, we had one thousand one hundred and um, ninety one delegates. So which means two thirds of that is about seven hundred and forty five or mm. so. And when they do the voting, nine hundred and eighteen people voted yes. 19 voted no and four void. So that 918 far ex exceed the two thirds where they be need when mm -hmm. are 745. So even if you exclude that 30, 35 people where people they talk about for mm -hmm. then serving five delegates and from then serving constituencies, enough for don't really affect the outcome. Mm -hmm. But We've been day under a court order. Okay. We'll give you specific dates when we for do the elections then day. Mm -hmm. We go then disrupt the elections. Not that we not go for conduct the elections. We were there. In fact, two or three of the elections they need, they be done complete. They be there in the process of counting where disruptions happen. So we begin a choice of whether for do a rerun, we will not be get time for because the time before elapsed. Mm -hmm. Or we make a report 
and send to the court. Mm -hmm. We we'll do that. We have the report. But we not send them. We don't we send. We not get instructions from the court on whether you should go ahead with the conference without those people or well, whether the, you should. The, the court give we order. Mm. Say do elections on certain days. Mm. Now the danger here was if we do reports now, we say then people here don't disturb this that. Some people will be held in contempt of court. And so in the 21 man committee meeting, we agree, say, look, for we are all APC. You know, we don't do elections. Courts no, we don't make provisions for runoff. We don't get time again uh, for go to runoff because the time where the court give we don't pass. Let us move on, you know, and so we don't do them report here, we don't submit. We can still form a quorum for the delegates conference and we you know say with the numbers of delegates available, we can still get the two thirds majority for the adoption of the constitution. Okay, the, 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 we are going to this convention with a lot of factions. You know, um, you get the NRM. We've been okay on Aguna Court Force. You get, um, um, you know, Alfred. We are the complainants on this matter. You get the big six and others. What have been the representation? You know, um, in in this um, Congress, we get. Well, first of all, you get to understand say we are all APC. Mm. That's now. Now that make that now one of the reasons we make are always be the comment the judge say you know because they try for be even when it give the order. So the twenty one man committee where I talked about earlier the composition at the at the court mm -hmm. so that the party forget ten plus the chair I mean nine plus the chairman we make and ten Alfred Peter Conte forget four including the secretary. And NRM two, big six two, mm. the diaspora three. So now we all that composition day. Now we sit down and plan the convention, even up to the agenda. Now that make in the opening, they all been get slot them for speak. Mm. NRM talk, uh, Alfred Peter Conte and representative talk, big six. Now they up to say they no one talk, but they were on the agenda for for sit, for make a statement. And then upset and all our make statements. And so we all went in to McKinney with a you know consensus, say, you know, we are APC. Okay. And we are glad You that are united. Uh, we are united. Okay. How how what's in the you assessment of um, you know, the because on a past law, say nobody know for campaign, nobody know for wearing t shirts. Um when are they going to this as as uh, for go adopt the the constitution. What in the party in general assessment of how una members them go into this? Because um you get a lot of people within on a party we want be leader, we want be flag bearer, everybody get in camp. And we've seen even where una need to meet up together, we plaba the come out. What in what in the party in general assessment of the meeting? I think that singular decision day we we take I mean for let nobody know where t shirt or get banner with the you know, help a lot for calm down, you know, situation. We overall assessment now that, you know, it been civil. You know, people, yes, there were arguments here and there, especially when it comes to certain provisions than within the constitution. Mm -hmm. But to a large extent, it been civil. I mean, I'm more of APC enjoying the normal, the usual, you know, enjoyment we did together, play music there. Of course, you will get one or two rowdy supporters, then we go say things or do things way not proper, but mm. to a large extent, it was civil, it was respectful, it was quiet, it was focused, it was very, very much uh, engaging. The deliberations then be very much enlightening, and I mean, people really. Be Will you say Una come out from that three days day united as a party? To a large extent, yes. There must mm. have been some uh, disappointments, of mm. course, as always, mm. because, like you say, there are camps. They are supporters of certain people. Mm -hmm. So things then they will some people be they expect inside the constitution where it not happen the way them before one time. So then they go on lead to disappointment. But uh that not means say we are we not commodity united. Of course, I mean <laughs> you know, mm -hmm. we get challenges, but to a large okay. extent, we left McKinney as a united party. Okay, before we can look up at the changes, uh, some of the changes so far in the constitution, let we let me look at this. Quickly, um, when I get members, Alfred Peter Conte and one person we been been Kerunago courts in the 
um, complainant at the case. And now in Twitter, and he posts this. He say, due to the blatant disregard for the rule of law by the EBK-led APC and the disenfranchisement of our APC comrades in Bo, Cambia, and Kono, I have decided to not attend the APC convention. I am distancing myself from a likely contemptuous letter of invitation written by the secretary. That now one. A go forward for say the EBK led APC file an appeal against the restraining orders for defendants one and two, and also against resolving all membership issues in the APC. Even though they lost their appeal, the ENDC did not resolve membership issues, and EBK chaired the event. We await order number 14 on the 16th. And a go further for say we should be thought that the behavior of the APC establishment not to comply with the high court orders will provoke a redress from the courts and thereby lead to a postponement of the impending emergency delegate convention slated for the 17th. That I enforce um, tweet, tweet, tweet. Now, this is not the possible way Kelna go court. Yes. And he's having issues with tweeting on Agodo na Makeni. Yes, and this is not the possible way get representation. Mm -hmm. Now the 21-man committee, mm -hmm. people will represent them. Mm -hmm. we but if he's not satisfied? Well, now we all sit on plan. So what so, if he's so, not satisfied? So this is where you have to, you know, also look in-depth. Mm -hmm as to the intent mm. of some of them people yeah, we, you know, because if you don't say, okay, I don't entrust, mm. you know, them people yeah, for represent me, including mm. the very person mm. where you give the power of attorney, mm. when I take the party go court, mm. uh, Rashid he say. Mm. Now we all been there, party 21 man committee. And so the decisions we'll take, those are not decisions we we'll imposed on them. Now we all agree. To a point that your representative go to Mamna stage on the first day mm. and talk. Mm. Then Boata. You know, and talk. And, and everybody and, we have been booing at him. And, and, he, and he, was, he was trying to give the position of Alfred, and, but everybody know, was booing at him in the hall. And, and, and then, you know. So isn't that the problem as well? So, well, so, so no, well, not really. Because, yeah, because we he, all he, want we are not even able to listen to oh, his positions. Someone because, was there to represent okay, him. We're not able to listen yeah, but to But then him. you get for also understand. Mm. People and frustration. Mm. We all wanted a constitution. We all wanted a democratic APC. Mm. We all wanted, you know, the APC to have elections, mm. you know, of all its executives. Mm. We did court and we asked the court for this. Mm. We all don't go sit down, we don't arrange, we mm. don't plan, mm. and then we go. Say, so, Lord, we go. We don't go. Now we do the agenda, mm. all of us together. Uh, 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 and then we go. Uh, 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 Alfred is, is concerned about, um, you know, president, former president Kuma serving as chairman. We, <laughs> you know, you know who I nominate former president Kuma for serve as chairman? Mm -hmm. Now the meeting. No. Now in representative. Okay. Ambassador Ibrahim Sori. Mm. Now nominate. Why, why former President Kuma not decline and say no? This is not. No, in no, line no, no. With he, he initially did. So, so in all fairness, mm -hmm. he initially did, mm -hmm. and we wrote again, mm -hmm. begging. We even went to his home in Makini mm -hmm. and gave him the reasons why we thought he should. But chair. he could say enough for participating. No, as this. delegates. He, but if he's serving and, and, as chairman and in this and whole and process, and why, should and it, and why shouldn't he stay and away? And why shouldn't and he just and go and observe? Also clarified our one day. Mm -hmm. The court not by him say mm. enough for participate as delegate. Mm. Now here is the complexity here. Former President Kruma is a member of NAC. The court bar all members of NAC, including him as chairman of NAC, from participating. But as chairman and leader, and his deputy chairman and leader, they're not bad. Eh? They began right for participate as delegate. He opted not to participate as delegate because as chairman and leader, the rest of the executive, the court don't bar them. So mm -hmm. he, he was still eligible to participate as delegate as mm -hmm. far as the court order was concerned. Mm -hmm. so you say he, he, Alfred is raising a concern here that yeah. according to the court, the understanding is if he's even going there, it might, is it that the APC can do without we can always do, we Kuma, can Kuma, always, President Kuma? We can always do without So why didn't President he just Kuma? go and, and observe the whole process no, and, but and if, be part but, of it? But, but, if, but if the 21-man committee Mm. Don't say we want you for chair. Even where I say no, I don't want chair. We say no ch for this particular conference because of ABC reasons. We want you chair. So I mean, he cannot turn his back on us just like that. Okay, so there is no problem with him chairing the no, only event. No, there was no problem. We not get any problem we with that. We don't get problem. No. That is okay. 
It is. Okay, let me let me let me go quick to and you're waiting one of our other senior members who was also a cabinet minister like yourself, um, Dr. Sylvia Blyden, waiting in self tweets. In the first tweet, he said, This is my first this is a first of my retorts to uh, former President Koma nonsense. Koma exposed ignorance when he said the pieces. Um, first existential threat was when Pasheki preferred J.S. Momo under on cool SI 1985. Okay. Um, the other one is saying is by Koma, who claims to have mentored all the ones he now calls APC Munku's features in this blockbuster movie, uh, the Super Munku himself. Those who clapped when an Eskuma, when an S said SLPP has not created problems for anyone in APC and that SLPP is causing problems, but APC people are, well, you are Munkus being treated so idiotic, idiotically by self confessed terrorists like Anes by Koma. You know, former President Koma's statement, <laughs> you know, raise, because he's chairman, he's raised a lot of tension. It seems within, within Lama, the party. Lama, I mean, from, from some of these people, even before President Krumah chaired the program, mm. we don't they see tweets, we've mm. seen tweets, we've seen attacks from them on him. So mm. it is not strange to us. Mm. Whether President Krumah had gone into that meeting and done the best mm. for them, it would be the worst. Mm. So, I mean, as a party, we have made a decision this is a bold step mm. we have taken to adopt our constitution. It has taken us closer to a more democratic APC. And that for us is fulfilling. Borders are not happy. Let me like read this final one from, from Sylvia. I say, <laughs> fraudulent makeup of APC delegates, fake convention equals to fake constitution. All because APC godfather of practitioners of Muku politics and his bicoma thinks he can fool all the people all the time. Um, there is a graph where it show the number of people them when a delegates. You get legitimate delegates where they green, when I just um, small percentage as, as you can see on the screen. Elected delegates, but elected by unpicked delegates, they in yellow, you can see them. Then EBKs and picked delegates, they in red, now the, now the chart. You can so, see so, the so, so because you, you feel, say, mm. you're not happy. Mm. So delegates. So Sylvia is no not happy. Is that no what wait. you're saying? No, I'm just. I'm no, coming. I'm asking. Is that no, what I'm you're saying? No, I'm not. I'm not speaking about Sylvia specifically. Well, well, I'm, I'm referencing Sylvia. So Sylvia's I'm just tweet. coming. So because somebody feels they're not happy mm. or not a part of the process. Mm. So even the delegates with an elect a handpicked election, mm. even where you have institutions. So are you responding so to Sylvia oh, of course, now? course. Even where you have institutions. So Sylvia is wrong. So even where you have institutions supervising the, the election. So mm. what, mm. Naham picked and still Naham picked so Sylvia during is the wrong. election. We do elections mm. and we elect the five delegates then from mm. the constituencies we, we, we the judge order we for mm. go do elections. Mm. And that is why we had the PPRC supervising those elections. Mm. So as far as we are concerned, no matter how somebody term mm. we do elections and those I, elections Is the party concerned about the issue Sylvia has been raising. She has been raising a lot of them. Like you say, even before um, when I go into this Congress, even all the other courts matters them. She has been raising a lot of issues, has been calling on um, former President Koma to step down in Tam Don Don, on a Tam Don Don, on a for left, and all that. Are you concerned? Is the party concerned? Recently, say, go for go contest na, na, na Kailan or so, she wasn't allowed to, to be part of the whole process. Is it that you not marginalize them, you're worried about them, or you're concerned about what she's saying or what she's talking about the party no, or calling for accountability? Nobody, not the way, we, we, not the, not the open door for accountability. Mm. But Sylvia is saying Our otherwise. door has not been shut mm. to accountability. But, you know, in all of this, with a deal with constitution, mm. it is very clear. Mm. Your interpretation not means say, we forgo by them. If mm. this is what the constitution say, if constitution make provision mm. for the chairman and leader of the party for select certain number of categories, mm. now the constitution make the pro of, of delegates, now the constitution make the provision. Okay. So, <laughs> you know, is the how party we concerned just, about Sylvia? As we are concerned about members? any party member we get something we for raised. Mm. But we also know, say, channels then they we and for. And she has not been using the channels? Of course not. Mm. So is that how would you refer to that anti party activity? No, well we don't we don't have that. We are making progress to a more democratic. But oh, the APC don't change from that. We we this uh, constitution mm -hmm. we would uh, we would adopt so mm -hmm. it define clearly mm. how for deal with people 
where they smear the party on social media and other media it's forums. You mean people like Sylvia? Is Sylvia smearing Generally, the party? Generally, I will not target Dr. Sylvia Blyden. No, I'm asking. No, I will not go not describe what you know, the acting publicity sector. Is she smearing your party? She's not following the right I will wait for the constitution to go into effect. Okay. Let me look at the other the issues them we come out now the um, convention. One thing we um, get the highlights now outside the former president, the, the party chairman and leader, Call on our members them um, for canting up and address them. Let me look at that quick, then we they can continue the discussion about the, the you issues. Know, the 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 All them problems here at this party, and then we are responsible. I go lead a jihad workable against any other man. The body, the party, the party don't tie another song. When I don't tie another song, when I don't have a problem again, another song. We are going to take all of this. And the party, they tell me, I say, we don't tie. Make you not. politics now I'm about this party. I'm in politics. We don't tie and we don't tie and we don't tie. Now I don't address anybody. Now munku munku politics. When I all don't agree so we have to work together in the interest of the party. That's now the APC party um, chairman and leader, and um, we've been chaired at um, Emergency Congress Day. But one person we, um, you know, get a reaction to waiting happen on that day. day. Um, now, Honorable Ibrahim Bundu, you know, one of the people that have been there at the committee, we plan everything. Let me listen to and quickly, we can get CD in reaction to all that. In fact, now we are the organizers, because me now a member of the 21-man committee. And... Uh, we come Namakini full of hope. We come Namakini for achieve so many things. We range from peace inside the party. We come to the to the constitution for that we can adopt them. And any other issues we get for do with the membership of our party uh, for that we can do them. So we all come very, very enthused. If you see the hall, you see the pre singing, the dancing, that tells you we all been come with a very, very, very good hope, upbeat, about waiting one can achieve, especially in the area of peace, especially in the area of uh, camaraderie, you know. So this, now one of the things this way, we all be hopeful. I must be very honest here both as uh, somebody of character, somebody of uh, a member of the APC party. You know, um, we'll get what we call among the speeches the keynote address. And believe me, with the agenda where they read, we all put together, the keynote address was going to be made, and rightly so, by the leader and chairman of our beloved party. So, of course, when it's a keynote address, now you get the key to all what you then don't say, all what you then don't do. Now you also don't take the notes. I mean, again, call and you with no again, call and keynote address. So, the keynote address really na in na the what you call the what, what, what you call the pinnacle, what you call the climax of yesterday's uh, convention. And uh, I believe now, now around that area, because after the keynote address, 
will not be get so much again for do except for announcement and we dispatch. Well, the keynote address, to put it mildly, now be a mixed basket, to say the least. The keynote address, by the hope of the people, including me, Naya, we are expecting a, a, a message of peace, message of reconciliation, and messages we go bring the party together. Well, I say a mixed basket because not to all waited and say was off tangent, but most of what came out was a, a bit in, uh, open to debate and interpretation way, unfortunate to say the least. But uh, we see blames, counter blames, who is responsible for this, who is responsible for that, words like undermine, words like, uh, you know, all of them thing and they, believe me, you must sense what you call divisiveness, you go sense what you call disunity, and for their statement, then they then come from the leader and chairman in the presence of the 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 the, 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 the mammoth crowd. We've been there inside our hall, and of course today with the advent of the social media, you see friends them, comrades them, highly respected people, highly placed people in our past government, and uh, currently still having that respect then parade them, put them in front of everybody and say, na den why na den poor liberty. That is a blame game. I don't th I think that, uh, that statement was unfortunate and uh, I think uh, we should have done better. That now Honorable Ibrahim Bundu, we na been um, majority leader and leader of government business na parliament and civil so and I want to you don't declare intention of being chairman for the APC party and in have been part of the 21-man committee, right? Yeah. And like you rightly <coughs> said, I'm be organized. You're for ma'am. You should have done better. How You you, you said I'm a politician. Of course. I mean, if my job, now that whenever we go sit down, we mm. agree on things. We agree so we, for unite. We agree to peace. We, are, mm. we sign MOUs. Mm. You know, we agree for work together as flag bearers. We go sit down, then put rest in a tray. We all sit down, we eat for sure. The public say we are united. Then we will come out there, you go inside, you support us for the beginning cause, the others, and social media. You, go, you know, I mean, that is so not that's right. Dr. Samoa, then they do. That, that, is, that is why he lined all of them up. Mm, and all of them. Including him. Mm. So that if anyone pardon, they do that practice, they then first stop. Because, I mean, the supporters, all of us are frustrated. We want to see a united but, but party. But Honorable Bundu is saying that demeaning, that that disrespectful to the I individuals. This this these are people where they provide leadership in one way or the other within on a party. At least there are better way where the the chairman could have said it in a keynote address than calling people and putting them against. Isn't former President Kuma putting? these people against the no, supporters of Funapati? No, I think all, he's tr all he, he, he really try to do is that, you know, trying to let all of us make that commitment, you know, sincerely mm. of working together. It, and a lot of these people, these delegates, you know, some of them not see, you know, them people are now the first time this. Mm. Then people are only get handlers in their con communities, their constituencies and all. Mm. And so, you know, we, we want to aspire for the flag. We get for show some amount of responsibility. We style of politics for be different. We target not for be, you know, the statements then we precede mm. that particular statement. I mean, if people are sincere enough, for don't guide we all proper, you know, for suicide when they really go. It's mm. unfortunate that people pick on that small part of the statement. Mm. But the keynote statement itself, where the chairman and leader make, but it, the was chairman all, and leader was it was all about... But the chairman and leader was pulling blame on himself. He said not to him the problem. It's not about pulling blame on himself. No, not to him the problem. No, no, no. He not to him the problem. No, he not to him the But he said it in that video. He said there were waiting up sooner than the problem. He not to him the party. He not to him the problem. He not to him the problem. He said we problem not to SLPP. We problem not APC. No, no, but when he was addressing these people, he said, they are the problem within the because party. Because these are all people mm. who are flag bearers or people representing flag bearers. Mm. Now I make a say, we hold problem now this flag bearer issue. Mm. 
That is why I said in statements that we precede this, if mm. people be play all, therefore understand mm. which side comes from. But he was from. blaming people say, rather than himself no, as of leader. He not take responsibility because of Lam anything. Because Lamrana, it is fact. Mm. We problem now APC, we don't for hide and a flag bearer issue. But why is he not now taking responsibility and the blaming others? the flag bearer others? aspirants, they so they cause no, problem for no me. problem as leader. He not for take any responsibility. It, it, the chairman and leader, mm. he say, then people here can go meet up. Mm. Then they meet, then they agree. Mm -hmm. They don't try for bring them together severally. Then they agree on steps them, how for unite. Where they come out and do. Lamrana, we don't sit down, we don't sign, we don't agree, say, all man for controlling Bobo and our social media. Mm. Nobody, not for making Bobo cause. But if me na flag bearer, I know me Bobo the way they post for me na social media. Okay. If then they still cause, I know for show leadership and bring them to books they know, stop it. Mm. What's he wrong so with that? So I make press for uh, oh, the yes. chairman and leader call them Munku. Oh, yes. Now Munku politician then. Oh, well, you know, oh, yes. And and, and there is no regret in that. Oh, Whatever well, Bundu say, this they show more signs of divisiveness. No, I don't and think so. I mean, we all just need for, I mean, we low understand the context. Mm. A lot will be sincere with we serve. I mean, look, even how honorable Bundu, for example, they behave. Mm. Now, we all do most of their arrangements there. All of them. Mm -hmm. Now we agree. Now we go. He said that. You know, he and, said that, but he was saying the keynote, the, the keynote statements for be something where they bring on a party together, not to something where go go, go but, sound but, the divisive. Yeah, but but now <laughs> how many people you don't hear it from? No, uh, Sylvia, I don't just read quotes from Sylvia, Sylvia is a Sylvia member, Sylvia but the boys the followed it. Was live. It was they live. Everybody, everybody followed it. Sylvia, you not remember them? The, 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 there is another. There is there. Alfred Seth not happy. We can go court. He's not happy about what happened. All of these people mm. get personal issues with EBK. So we're not concerned. Okay, we concerned. It is personal, both. I mean, you can tell. Mm. It is so, personal. So, so all of them concerns are not uh, anything about the party. It's about the issue with EBK. I mean, look at the tweet. It's EBK, EBK, EBK. But he's the chairman and leader. It's, EBK, it's personal. I mean, that is why I said, for us, our focus as a party now, we don't take a bold step. Mm. Adopting the constitution. We they pray that it goes through the PPRC stage. We mm. they pray that we will go back to court on the 6th mm. and tell the judge all what he would undo and hopefully get a, a clean bill and then we go move forward and try to get a formidable executive from the polling center level all the way up. Look, we get a very good constitution. We, then TR they make we're not even able to talk about. Okay. Yeah, because... So the, the constitution, the, the, they can't talk about the constitution, but then concerns there as a party how, of course, we take, take, take them serious. Mm -hmm. I don't talk earlier, say, anybody we write something but we party or we raise concern, we always they take them serious. Mm. I want to let you understand, say, when, for example, Dr. Silva Bly, they begin right, but the party months and months and months ago, the party call out to a meeting. Mm. They call out to a meeting. At some point, they even be there attend NAC meetings. Mm. You understand? Mm -hmm. When you say problem a personal, it gets personal well, issue. Well, you know, because I know at in no say mm. if it is not, a get we wake in channeling. In, so you believe in, say in it's problems. personal between here and EBK? It is, well that is my, my my honest belief. Okay. Let me can talk about the constitution. But quickly, um from uh, the party chairman and leader talk about how he's tired he's he's wanting to go. Is he even going, going to, ready to resign or leave you guys to one thing? It gets deputy, no? Why? Why? No, they, they left. So they left. So they left before the even... The chairman and leader, they left. Okay. They left. Is he going to resign soon? They left. Okay. Is he going to resign? They left. There is an intention <laughs> for him to leave soon? He's, he wants to leave. Soon? Is that going to happen soon? Uh, sooner rather than later. Okay. Let me look at the constitution now. You know, one thing where don't be, um, you know, the critical issue, uh, the selection clause and that of membership. Yes. You know, um, the, the issue about former VP Sam Sumana and that of the selection clause. What's in this new constitution they say? Well, the selection clause, first of all, on go. Mm. I mean, there is nothing about selection or consultation. It's strictly elections for all positions, mm. from polling center uh, executive all the way to flag bearer. Polling center is the smallest unit 
that has been added. Now, the car will be the same zona executive okay. there. Now, now, polling center executives. Okay. All the way up to flag bearer. Now, elections now. Mm. Of course, in terms of membership, we don't clearly define which thing they make you member. You know, how you go become a member. I mean, if you're not a member, you left, and then you decide for come back, how you go come into the party. You get for come back as a new member. Um, then, of course, um, you know, if the National Delegates Conference expel you, now they for readmit you back, not to knock, as we initially proposed now the Constitution. And, of course, we also define eligibility criteria for offices. Mm. Are you waiting to qualify you for run for office? Mm -hmm. The tenure of their offices then they. Mm -hmm. We like for example the chairman, which by the way would all separate chairman and, and leader. leader. Yes. Okay. Now we get chairman, we get leader. You know So waiting at the difference. The, the difference the is the flag bearer and the leader? Yes, the presidential candidate they become leader. Okay. And when he win election, he remains leader and a deputy. Mm -hmm. In running mate, the vice could become deputy leader. Mm. But if he lost four months after election, if he resigned that position, and we still go get chairman. Okay. And the reason is because we want the party for continue for function, even when we are in governance. The president for focus on the work, the chairman focus on the party administration. And that make we even say, would I ever get for run for chairman? You know, for getting any intention for run for flag bearer. Okay. Because all other positions, if you don't resign six months before the, the conference, we say they go elect flag bearer if you want for be flag bearer. And also their offices, then they get tenure now. You know they run for one office for more than two terms of three years. So if you don't get elected as chairman, you don't do the first three years, you can be elected for another three years. After that, you know they run again. What's in the constitution say? What's in the criteria for be um, presidential <laughs> candidates? <laughs> if I don't be at least with the party in good standing, at least five years continuous. Okay. To the elections. So to somebody will be non come out, we be no resign from the party, then when I retake him back. If you not complete the five years, is definitely not. He qualified. has to start from zero. From so one. if somebody be not resign where they can at the party, they start as a fresh member. Correct. So he's not qualified to contest for. No. He's not completed. So does this mean Chief Samsumana is 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 out of of if this if this constitution that you've adopted, if you go through the old process and Gazetta may become law, it means he's out of the race. Well, I don't want to be specific. No, he is one person. He's yeah, the because one person. it go look like if I do that, it go look like now for I will write the constitution, mm. and that is not the case. Okay. You know the right constitution for one single person. Okay. I mean, we in fact, I always they tell people and say the term we will begin for draft this constitution. Chief Sam's man and Obi don't even express interest for come back now the APC yet. Mm. So he was never on our minds when writing this constitution. So now I make a knocking leg for using No, but case he is in the picture now. He is individual sight. in the picture now. He was there before the, the, the chairman and leader call him, calling team. Say, when I come, now they all know the problem. He was accused as being part of the problem. Yes. So he is in the picture now. Does that mean he's... he's he Until the constitution not going to affect No, it. I'm asking if now the constitution they talk about now. Yeah. If the constitution go, um, it means he's out of the race. Well... Maybe, maybe not. I mean, because you get for also look at in situation, in mm. circumstance is different. So the party go look at yeah. the situation. Correct. But you just say anybody where they come as uh, the party will be the resign, you start from zero as an ordinary zero. member. That is but when I get exception, that is, is that no, what you're no saying? exception, absolutely. That is the provision in the constitution. So mm. I, now that made me want for focus my argument on the constitution. I now want for make judgment on what. The so, uh, so will, will this will not leave, like where the, 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 the chairman and leader say, he identify Chief Samsuana as one of the problems, the people who the cause problem within the party. Will this not lead to more problem within the party, him thinking that he's been marginalized, he's been taken out of, of Well, of not the really. Now that make also before that statement, the, it talks say Samsuana herself one come back mm. and a position. So Samsuana is not a member so of your party yet? Samsumana was expelled by the National Delegates Conference. Mm. And I just tell you, see, and even in the 95 con uh, Constitution, that's how it is. When National Delegates Conference expel you, now the highest decision-making body in the party, okay. a lower body, not the overturn them decision. So okay, until then, it, we until then correct. So he's, t he's not a member? Uh, well, his membership now completed. But how the chairman and leaders will call him and identify Because it don't pass through NAC. 
okay. stage. And you know, so that's okay, there is another there is another partner the constitution we talk about young generation, you know, um about youth league National and young youth generation. League. Yes, yeah. what's the difference? Well then now the nomenclature then change actually from National Youth League to Young People's Congress. You know, in, in the APC we get Congress for women, you get Congress for veteran, you know, so then you see you know, we forget Congress for young people mm. instead of we they say National Youth League because now the same kind structure and organ then get mm. now the same kind election process then they go through. Mm. So instead of them being referred to as a league, we don't did it for over for years since they formed the league. This the circumstances don't different. Okay. So now it then see say in, in necessary for change and to young people's And waiting at the age, waiting the Lord they say, would I, would I qualify for being youth leader? I'm a young man. Mm. I'm a young man, so... You don't know what the age? <laughs> youth age, not a... Not a uh, well, that is why it is no longer youth. Mm. It's young people. Oh, so it's young generation. All right, we so have it, to it's, now it's do... It's not determined we, by we, your age. We have to probably... So 56, 60 percent, we if have you think to probably do a regulation to guide that. Okay. Yes. Uh, the final one we're going to ask, and this honorable Lai Mara, when I want to a member of parliament, poses, says just like the issues of paramount chiefs in parliament, they, they have no relevance in parliament, but politicians are afraid of to mention it. That's the way it was during the APC convention. The world legal team is all over the new constitution. Delegates were just grumbling, but no one with guts to contest it. 15 delegate status at national delegate conference, NAC members, members of the national executive committee, and members of regional executive. Now the legal team make the new constitution, now they present them, and now they then serve um, poor power. My question is, how is this APC legal team constituted? That's not a question from well, one of our lawmakers. We lawmakers, and we represent the APC. Well, the, the fact of the matter is not to the legal team, no more do the constitution. Mm -hmm. And in fact, uh, yes, we have so many lawyers on the constitutional review committee. But I go stay here with, with no hesitation that if you count the number of people will be actively involved by this constitutional review from start to end, I don't go count 10 people then. Mm. And I go only count about four out of the lawyer, plenty lawyers, then they will be fully involved. Mm. You know, so not to them no more, that is one. Secondly, I mean, you always, now circumstances and situations, mm. they, you know, inform decisions where they make as an institution. And I also go guide you how you go forward. Mm. Nobody no go question the role where the lawyers they don't play these three years who don't go into opposition. Okay. I mean we see them value, we see them relevance, we see them contribution. I always can tell them say I say if not to be una the lawyers then and some of we will determine. By now, a different thing we would talk about the APC. Okay. But you guys stood up. So now, based on the relevance, make una recognize and so and then put contributions, them. then relevance. All of them different groups then they mm. are based on the relevance. Okay. Now, based on the, the relevance of the diaspora, make them one increase then quota to about fifty delegates. Okay. Now, based on the relevance of former ministers, make them say they forget delegate status. So the you former know. ministers when I get position for former ministers. Well, they are all affiliate bodies. So okay. then can send in two two delegates each. Then fall on the affiliate bodies. Quickly, what's in our waiting on a waiting the constituency say about women? You know, women oh. empowerment is very, very important. We see the gender bill they go on and then they encourage political partisan for ensure say then give more symbols and opportunities to women. What's in the constitution they say? We constitution very progressive, I can tell you, for women and persons with disabilities. Okay, for women, first of all, we don't make them a must. Mm. I mean the delegates them because initially we put them lightly, but the delegates, they, <laughs> they <laughs> order we for even make up, you know, more, um, you know, guarantee that any time we didn't have power, mm -hmm. it is a must, we for allocate minimum 30% of all appointment positions to, to women. women. Yes. That sounds good. Oh yes, that mm -hmm. is one. Then for elective positions, because we don't say in the constitution, say, mm all positions get for be elected for. We cannot take such affirmative action mm. as in a, So what do we do now that? We say the party for make them a must for ensure say and make the atmosphere safe, 
and conducive for women for able to compete for all positions in okay. the party. So even outside and get for elect them, Correct. it will be comfortable. It will be comfortable, it will okay. be convenient, it will be safe. Okay. And you know, this election their elections they also will complete. I see positive signs in that. Okay. Because I've, I noticed say because to a large extent they be safe, they be inclusive, they be very, very much clear, the woman they be understand, plenty of them compete. Okay. And I get one part some constituencies that were at two elections, like one one three, for example, out okay. of the five, now four women they elect. Okay. So where you be there, where we be there at the hall, they notice say it was almost 50-50. Mm. You get plenty of women the way they elect all across the country. So mm. we see and say, now for just make the atmosphere conducive. And we don't only stop the, even when we go by that electoral legal reform, mm. as a party, these are things we'll bring up. That during general elections, we for make them safe, we for make them, we for put laws them, where they make people be held accountable, people where they make it difficult for women for come out openly and compete. Mm. Mm -hmm. We for suspend practices such as secret society yeah. practices we, you we know, affect women them. Them. Yeah. Mm. You know, we even suggest that we for remove nomination fees mm. for women and persons with disability mm. where they contest for parliamentary and council seats. Mm. These are all for improve their participation. Okay. And for persons with disability, then self we also now because before they be the on, under an organ. Okay. So now we don't make they don't stand out on their own. And they now get representation at the National Delegates Conference, five delegate status, mm -hmm. and they also now get a seat at the National Advisory Committee. That sounds, in, in all of this, um, you know, where political party then they try for empire, especially women and disabled people, they mm -hmm. can be good. It means progressive, it means say, we can't get a progress. Yeah. Um, with, with the call for more empowerment for women and with the gender bill, I think um, that now is very good. We hope other political party then go follow suit. But see, the, with all this, we think on our hopes for 2023, you're not going to be on a presidential candidate, self. I think the battle line is still open. Mm. It's possible to say CDI at Tunis Put on a young candidate. March. I don't get candidates. You're not a candidate for yourself? It's possible, yes. Yusef, are you declaring that you'll be contesting? I, it is possible. I mean, I, I watch the situation. Mm. You did contest you know, for B flag bearer for the 2023 election? I don't say I go win. If mm. I do, so mm. I study the situation, and if I see and so say with you or someone else, what's in our chances? I think uh, if we are united as a party mm. and we put a very good program to the people of this country, mm. you know, we go win 2023. Are you as sure? As long as we ensure mm. that the elections are free, fair, and credible, and we're able to protect the votes of the voters. We'll go in. Uh, are you sure after this convention I the APC will be united? I or am certain. With all these concerns, Sylvia Blyden, Gerald Fred, you get Honorable Bundu and all, you think? I mean, the, the thing about the APC disagreements, we know they ever allow for result to enmity. Mm -hmm. Now that makes you see, we'll go right, right, we'll go hala hala, but when we meet, we are comrades. Okay. We go hug. I don't go see Sylvia or anybody I attack her. Um, Sylvia don't go see me, attack me. We go smile and hug. Mm -hmm. You know, that is APC. So then disagreements there are not mean say we don't go come together. Okay. Thank you very much, um, CDR Tunis. Um, you know, we are the acting publicity secretary for the APC. We don't talk about governance. Um, again, what are you mark for former for, for 25%. Person? Okay. Um, we don't talk about governance. He assess, as always, we can get politicians there, for especially from the opposition, okay, ask them for assess the government, again, the ruling party and the president, 25%. So hopefully, in the, in the years to come, we'll get them back for whether a mark will go up or will come down. But thanks very much, CD. We don't talk about the APC party, um, constitution where they don't adopt. We don't talk about issues within the party. Now, here hot seats going today. Plenty of thanks to the technical team and the production team for their help with the program. And when we view them, we don't they give on a comment them on our Facebook page. So we'll meet back next week. I'm Amadou Lamganaba. Thanks for watching um, Hot Seats and continue for watching YV. We are chairman of Renaissance. I and Renaissance was considered to be an independent body that advocates for change. Let me put it down. So I'm not asking you to ask about. about you we are, you are Minister of Information, where President Kuma announced austerity measures from State House. Yes. 
No matter if you're in street quality education, as I am against that, I will not accept. This is not President Leo's street quality education. So the economy went bad from your own time. Disciple. In a bioist or yes, in a, in a power. I will feel it difficult for interpret the, the connotations there. As the anti-corruption commissioner, have you been approached to be compromised or corrupted in the matter you are investigating? Don't they talk about the ills of the country for years, mm -hmm. five years to election? I know them. President Bio at the time, Nabi Mumu. Watching AYV Television.